Nelson escaping Holiday. The long for Howard. Oh, wow. man. And hard. 45-39. Another. Howard again with a quick move and a spin left. Throws it in the face of McGee. To be the help guy on any penetration. Courtney Lee not able to hit, but wait. Charlotte has just dominated his side. Oh. Dwight with a big time. Oh! Set on the year, so he's a real good shot. Dwight takes it down the baseline for the. From Howard. Ball loose. Howard comes up with a steal. Can they still get it? Yep. Good hustle with Nelson. Alley oop. Oh! Clocks at four. Oh! Dwight! Slips that screen and Simmons throws it right to the front of the rim. Yeah, the Hornets version. Count by the door. Backing in, crossover. Oh, what a two-handed slam. I just shot my shot at this little dot. I'm trying to create that neck on her big neck. My nigga selling crazy. What's up, YouTube? It's Jordan. I'm back in the video. It's going to be a big body banger. Jacob Musway. Two video now first things first make sure you like comment subscribe you're on a 4k you know what i'm saying today i am the build deal on your local corner and i'm coming at you with this dwight howard next gen build video yes sir this was requested on next gen a lot of y'all really wanted to see it so here it is today you know i had a good time making this build it was definitely dominant definitely very accurate and it definitely gave what it was supposed to give you know what i mean uh with this build for, i feel like it was a very straightforward build to make you know Obviously, Dwight Howard doesn't have any shooting, you know, so I could pretty much make it a typical type of big man build, but it's not a typical type of big man build. It is very dominant, very dominant in the post, very dominant in the paint, and very dominant on the block on defense. So I really hope y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all want any new builds, make sure y'all comment it down. I know I had a couple of requests for like Dyson Daniels and Shaden Sharp, and they'll get I'll get to them soon, you know. So until then. Just sit tight, keep on requesting any videos that y'all want, and I'll get to them. Without further ado, let's get right into the attributes that I use for this Dwight Howard bill video. So as you see, I made him six foot ten, two hundred sixty-five pounds, with a seven-eight wingspan and a defined body build. I feel like he definitely does look like Dwight as well, you know, in terms of muscu, you know, like his muscularity. Is that a word or muscu? muscle whatever but yeah and dwight howard in real life is six foot ten so that is what i made him very accurate as well so with this build it is definitely a dominant post scoring build like literally it's insane you know it has a 90 post control 99 close shot 95 standing dunk uh what like a 79 driving dunk you know a 95 block rating max style physicals you know like it can literally do everything on the court as a big man you know except for shoot you know and i mean in a dwight howard build if you're looking up a dwight howard build i hope that you don't expect shooting because yeah you get like a 49 mid-range so if y'all want to try to shoot mid-ranges with that go ahead be my guest but dwight Dwight Howard definitely isn't known for his shooting ability. You know, not saying that he can't shoot. In my head, all NBA players can shoot. They're in the NBA for a reason. There's no way you get into the NBA without at least having the ability to make a jump shot, right? So I know that he can shoot. I know that all NBA players can shoot, but it's more about tendencies. Will a player shoot? You know, will a player shoot a mid-range? Dwight Howard's not shooting a mid-range, okay? But he has all of the other attributes here. You see, I gave him high ball handling as well and uh, max out speed with ball for his size so that he is able to take it in transition and get those drives because Dwight Howard is very fast, you know, for his size. Well, at least prime Dwight Howard, very fast, you know, speeding up and down the court, getting chased down locks, catching lobs and transition, you know, definitely a transition threat. Uh, even now, you know, like it wasn't until a couple years ago where he didn't average a, a double double, you know, so definitely is an underrated player and his stats definitely go overlooked just because he's not as great as prime Dwight Howard just because he had different roles you know after the Lakers season I feel like he kind of fell off a little bit but that's okay like fell off in terms of popularity and stuff but that is all right but see with this build like I said it's very straightforward you have OP defense you know OP post scoring and 
OP physicals, and that's pretty much all you need for a Dwight Howard build. Now for the takeover, you see I went with stuff blocks and advanced post moves. You have access to the rim protecting takeovers, glass cleaning takeovers, and uh, post scoring takeovers. So you can pretty much combine those however you want. And you see I've built a paint beast, which is definitely a great name for a Dwight Howard build. Shades of Bill Russell, Andre Drummond, and Clint Capella. I definitely do think that Clint Capella comparison is really good. Um, the other two, uh, I don't really think so, you know, but I was hoping to get a Dwight Howard comparison, but I don't think I was going to get that in this game, but it is what it is. But as you see, the badge spread for what I have is definitely very spread. I have a lot of badges. Obviously, I don't have any shooting badges. That's pretty self-explanatory. Once again, it's a Dwight Howard build. Don't expect to get any shooting badges. But for the areas that I did get badges in, I got a lot of them and a lot to use. So the finishing, you know, playmaking and defensive badges definitely came in handy. Now for the actual gameplay, as I was saying before, it is a very, very dominant build. Like it can score literally from anywhere, get rebounds, get blocks. I said from anywhere, obviously it can't score from anywhere. It can score literally anywhere in the paint, you know, get to the paint, get rebounds, get blocks, get past your defenders, you know, play on the block, do post hooks, drop steps, post spins. If you want, you know, up and unders, like it's just stuff like that, that separates it. It's pretty much a 6'10 slashing defender. You know, it's obviously a two way type of player. Um, and Dwight Howard definitely is a two way player, you know, prime Dwight Howard, the, the amount of defensive, like effort that he gave on every possession was ridiculous. Man's was averaging like over two, three blocks a season, you know, 1.5 plus steals a game. I feel like he won two defense player of the years. You know, like people forget how amazing Magic Dwight Howard was. That man carried the Magic team with uh, what Hito Turkoglu to the finals. Like that, that gets overlooked so much. You know, he beat LeBron James. Like a center carrying a team is rare. Like we see centers in the league right now that are great, like Joel Embiid, Nikola Jokic, but they can't carry a team to the finals without having some good guard, you know, or some great role player or great whatever. But Dwight Howard did that. You know, it's pretty much like the LeBron James effect. You know, Dwight Howard on the Magic was like LeBron James on the Caps, you know, like he definitely changed that franchise around for what it however long they've been in a rut since the Penny Hardaway and Shaq days, you know, and definitely made them contenders again. I mean, they went to the finals, you know, but once he left to go to the Lakers, him and Shaq, I feel like they didn't mesh the most. I said Shaq, him and Kobe didn't mesh the most, um, but still he was averaging double doubles and it went overlooked just because he wasn't as great as Prime Dwight, which sucks to say. But still, you know, this build definitely re resembles Prime Dwight, you know, to a T and I had a good time making this build. But yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, run over to 4K. I hope y'all enjoyed the build. If y'all want any builds, let me know. But until then, I'm out. Peace.